yeah, see what, yeah, how you doing, man? Yeah. What's your name? So, Ty. Ty, I'm Darren. Ty. Very nice to meet you, my friend. Yeah. Right. Shalom so, to all of you, and um, um, Shalom alaikum. Well. Right. Evening or afternoon and morning. Walaikum salam. I've been, I've been, I've been coming speakers corner for a long time. Maybe as long as some of you, and maybe not as long as some of you, but. I, I, I'm doing this as an introduction, so you know who I am, or what I am. And what you believe. We, just hear me out. Yeah. You, I know, let's not start off on the wrong foot, yeah? Let me explain what I know about you, so we don't need to get into it, yeah? You know about me? Yeah. Okay. Just so we don't get off on the wrong foot. Okay. Why I've invited you through this um, man here, is so we can have a dialogue about what I know that is messing all of you up. Okay. Yeah? I don't want to fight. Seriously, anyone who wants to fight with me, if I'm the same weight category and so on, let's do that in a boxing ring. That's the invitation. I'm not a fighter. I'm your brother, but we're going to look at stuff. So I'm not here to argue and put you down and disrespect you. Da, 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 da. That's, not the, that's not the case here. The case is there's a lot of stuff that people are talking about in Speaker's Corner. They've been talking about it for some time, and it gets to a point where it's all lunacy. It's lunacy, because everyone started off on the wrong foot, like by a million yards, and they can't even return to where they, where they should be, which is primary school. Primary school where we can all learn and have an equal common foundation of what we're doing before we start off. But with the advent of YouTube and social media, everyone's become a teacher. Everybody's a teacher now. It don't matter where, how, what. It's, everybody's just teaching. But they will tell you they've got teachers in whatever they're doing. So how they qualify to be a teacher, I don't know. I'm doing this out of love because I see humanity first. And if it's true that we come from one creator and it's him we're looking to serve, we need to hear this. We need to do this. If you just want your religion to be true, to be right, hey, by all means, there's no compulsion, as they say, in religion. Oh, okay. But what I say is this. You can make your religion truth, or you can make truth your religion. Choose one. All right, OK. Um, I came here because apparently you said you can challenge any Muslim to a debate. Is that true or not? Today? I Apparently, someone said to me that you think you can challenge any Muslim in the park yeah, to a debate. You did say that, okay. So, I've accepted that challenge. Okay. okay. So, what's your point? Did you not hear it just now? I, I, I heard you ramble. I heard you talking about you not... We, we started disrespect already. I, I, you know, I laid out an introduction. To be all honest... But I don't before, know what your point was. I still don't... Before, before okay. everyone, I laid out an introduction. You laid out an introduction. Then you asked me what's my point. All right, all right. First thing, you laid out an introduction, yeah, and I listened to your introduction Are intently. Are you the camera? Because uh, if you want to be so demand, can this can... Cameras? Be... Where do you want to start? Oh, no, no, I mean, sorry. I didn't even see... I'm sorry. I didn't see that. Don't worry. Titans, as we have asked. The man I invited to invite uh, anyone who wants to... I'll handle it. Okay, okay. Are you, come on, uh, come on. Are you... Oh, you want me to stand there? I don't know. I not want you to. Where do you want me to stand? No, but it's just that I want this to go out. I just, I really want this to go out. Okay. Yeah. I okay. Mean, you can, you can, you can line us up properly. I mean, okay. I, I've got my own small little camera here. Okay. If it works or not is another thing. Do Don't worry, it'll be on YouTube, you'll see it. No, you see, look. YouTube is just a platform for us to reach each other. I'm going to start introducing myself once you finish speaking or introducing yourself so people know why I'm here. Why do you introduce me? You, you said you know me. No, no, I can't. Sorry. L let's not start like that. Well, let's you, do the thing yourself. No, you started like that. You started that. Anyway, all right. So anyway, I, I... One thing I would like to do as we speak. Go on. Because, um, a lot of people come here and they say, you don't let me speak, you speak over me, blah, 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 blah. And I would say, I wish we could have a speakometer to see who speaks the most. So there won't be any argument, you didn't let me speak. You want? Not even so. Um, yeah, I think you're about 10 minutes ahead of me already. <laughs> <laughs> so, I can be the timekeeper if you want. No, guess why I'm ahead of you here, because, you know... No, you did your introduction. Yeah. All right, right. You... I'm just trying to say, I don't want us to fight first. I really don't want us to start fighting first. All right, all right. Can we just start like brothers at home? Well, I'm doing it like we did. You know? Like, you know me at home. 
You don't argue with your brother at home. You just look for what you can agree with. You want to eat some rice? Oh, no, 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 no. oh, come on. I don't wonder. I'm not here for that. Uh, My age is close to 50. I don't know your age, so I don't go into childish games. You understand? Uh -huh. All right, hands on. Would you like to stay off? Okay, um, again. I was told that you made a challenge that you can deal with any Muslim in the park. And you said that's true, yeah? I would wish you to use the words I used. Because that introduction... I didn't hear that. That was a verbatim. I didn't hear that verbatim. I heard it. Someone use, told me. Don't use words oh, which all right, are not all right. uplifting to all of us. All right. You can deal with any Muslim. Right. Th then that you that said, happened. and then you said, you know me. So I can only see. I said here. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. what I'm saying to you. Yeah. So you said you know me, so I'm assuming you've watched videos or whatever. That's all I know. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Then you said, what was the other thing you said? Oh, yeah, right. Then you did a, a five minute introduction. Okay. Of myself. Yes. Yeah. And I asked a simple question What's your point? Because I don't know what you're talking about. I really don't know what you're talking about. And there's not an insult. Right. I'm not putting you down. Okay, Wait, one second, one second. I'm not putting you down. It's just that you might, you know what you're here to do, yeah? But all you did was uh, let us. Say what I'm going to say nicely. I'm not going to be this. I'm not here to do that. We're not all teachers. You, you're not a lot of stuff, yeah. What's your point? What are you here to prove today to a Muslim today? What are you here to prove? All right. Are you here to prove anything? First thing. Okay. Is that two questions or one? Okay. <laughs> answer, answer as you like. No. Did you see that? It's a simple question. Is that two questions or one? Uh, what are you here to do? Okay. You collapsed. He actually <laughs> collapsed. Can you no, it's on video. I know. I know. <laughs> That's why I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to prevent collapse before we start talking. Okay, I'm here. I'm not, I'm not into, I'm, I'm not into this um, going lefts and rights and smoking the wind and smoking mirrors, yeah? All I'm interested in is you, for, for a third party, I didn't hear it from your word, your lips, I'll accept, that you've made a challenge that you can defeat any Muslim in the park or uh, debate any Muslim in the park, whatever it is. Whatever way you said it, you said it. All right. When I asked you that earlier on, you said yes. I said that. Okay. So now I want to know what you think you know, or what you think you can prove to me today. I'm a Muslim in the park. Yeah. Now I don't. Yeah. So if you want to debate Black History, forget me. <laughs> right. I'm the wrong person. So this is, why, this is why I asked initially. What's your point? All right. If anyone would be honest. And if Allah is the true creator, yeah. in front of him, he heard what I said, okay? And I'm going to repeat it. Let me not verbate him, but you can hear the same thing again. Yeah. A lot of teachers have sprung up over the last two decades about religion, yeah. okay? Because that's the most important thing that we're dealing with at the moment. Like one brother said, he said, before in Hyde Park, it used to be a good intellectual ground for people to come and learn and share ideas and so on. Besides the history, of course. But now it's just become a big outside mosque. That's his words I've used. A big outside mosque. A big outside religious arena. That's all it is now. But people ain't even searching for truth. They just want their religion to win. Football, politics. I just want my football team to win. It don't matter if we're rubbish. Who's recording the speakometer? Am I speaking now? You're, you're, you're repeating what you just said initially and you still not made your point. I'm introducing myself. You did that once. So here we go now. Get to your point. What's your point? I'm not going to waste my time debating something that I've got no knowledge of, yeah? Or I'm not, I'm not as deep as knowledge as you as, yeah? I don't know everything. I don't claim to. Look, brother. You, so just make you your wanna, point. If you want to run right now, this is the time to do it. <laughs> You know what? Yeah, but you haven't made your point. He, he don't know. He don't. Exactly. I beg you. Wait, can you be a bit more boring, please? <laughs> Tell us what your point is, man, so you can educate us. Well, if my point is Your're actually worth more than one minute to state, <clears throat> would you not let me state it? You've had 20 what minutes. Is, Come on. Oh, you see, the, see the first because line? Who's going to walk can away? You see the minute? first line. I've had 20 minutes. Uh, well, who's got the that's speakometer? That's a lie now, and that's Allah's lie. How long have we been rolling for? That's a lie. How long have we been rolling minutes? for? I've been speaking for five. Yeah, but he's saying that uh, but look, Allah's lying now. When you were when you when you were speaking, did I stop you? This is the problem. Ten minutes. All right. Sorry, I take that back. Ten minutes. I'm gonna make a point. A point we're trying to make is people are talking about. They don't use this word. I'm the one injecting this word into their consciousness. The creator. 
they're talking about gods. My God, my God, my God. Is Jesus God? Is this God? Is that God? Which God do you believe in? So who is God? Blah, blah, blah. And they don't define anything. They don't start from any way of any scientific, i.e. check the thing first. Can I ask a question? You said you see my videos? Well, I have to, I have to. Well, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why I'm interrupting you. No, I'm, I'm going to tell you. No, I'm going to tell you. No, subject's on point, all right? I have never spoke about my God. I always speak about creator and science. So, and you said you know me. Now you're sure you don't know me. It's not you I'm talking about. So who are you talking about? Who else is today? You see the problem here? Are you making dialogue with me or the crowd? Well, I'm introducing myself. You How much introduction do you want? You asked me what am I about, right? So no, I didn't, I didn't ask you what you were about. I didn't ask that you at asked, all. What's my point? I asked, why have you... Sorry. You said you can challenge Muslims in the park. Any, any Muslim in the park was your word. Uh, right. <laughs> Anyway, no, you get, it, right? It, it, so it, it, I need it, to know it, it, what the it, it, challenge it, 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 is. Look, Sarah challenged me in the we park. Go. Well, we're going to show you how it works. Let's show you how it works. Sarah challenged me. We debated. I said to him, what are you going to prove? He told me he's going to prove to me that when I speak to people about Allah, it makes no sense. At least he had honest enough to tell me his point. All right? Now, I'm asking you the same question. What is your point? If somebody asks a question, will they wait for the answer? Well, or now must they stop the person answering and ask another question? And you say you're a Muslim. Where I come from in Africa, Muslim. Oh my God, yeah. what's your point? Oh, yes, that's my point. What's Where your point? I come from in Africa, Muslims listen a lot. <sighs> don't matter what you have to say, they listen to you first. If they, they don't, sometimes they don't even answer on the same day. They Anyone say, got a ladder for this guy? I'll get back to you. That's patience. That's virtues. What we got today is all these um, YouTuber children coming out here with a beard, <laughs> behaving like a woman, essentially. <laughs> see the laughter again? No, you can see the Well, laughter. you're saying comical things. <laughs> you, you make me laugh. The laughter. Are you going to make your point? This is part of my point. Kalam, Kalam, what's this about, mate? Don't get, you don't need to let, let, let look. Uh, you, oh, we're going to see. If you're a man, all right. let a man speak. I don't got a chair. What's your point? If you wait for it, you've ordered. You've ordered. It's freezing cold. Everyone wants to hear your point. They wanna. So it's not even you anymore. How long do you need? How long do you need to introduce for? And I'll shut up. Five minutes. Five minutes. Now, do we need to implement timekeeping? I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's yeah. be yeah. the timekeeper. Let yeah. Be the time yeah, we do. All right, we'll do a stopwatch. Well, right. Two minutes. Yeah. Out late intro. Introduce. That's brilliant. That's brilliant. Here we go. Three minutes. Two minutes each. Question time. Question time. Let's go. Three minutes. Three minutes. Who first? Yeah. You go first. You. Now, this, Please. Look, my name is and, and look for the for the record. When one man is speaking, can the other not interrupt? Please. Okay. No problem. Shh. Everyone calm down, yeah? The crowd can say anything, but the man in the ring, can he just like respect what, that? Talking now? I know I'm still talking. You don't need to stop me, I'm still talking anyway. Okay, you're it's part of my talk. You play me with doing nothing. Yeah, but the time's ticking, brother. The time's ticking, bro. <laughs> See, what they want what the Muslims want to reduce this to is what you call that? What's that word again? It's just sh everyone just doing what, speaking what they can because it's free to speak. Those who lead us, they've said, give the people confusion. That's enough for them. Confusion is enough. It will keep them busy from the time they're born to the time they die. I'm not here for that. I'm here for truth. I've said, bring a Christian here, bring a Muslim here, and truth is here to speak to both of them. But they won't come. When one comes, it's a rambler who don't want to hear nothing unless he can speak over it. Okay, but well, you've been teaching for a long time. I draw a line under that. My point here basically is this. Religion today, Islam, because I'm, I'm gonna be chatting to a Muslim today, it's not a debate. Because before we start a debate, I want to make sure he's educated enough. I don't debate with people who are not educated. We talk first. We just talk. And you can teach me, I'll soon find out. If I can teach you, you soon find out. Religion is satanic. Islam is satanic. Christianity is satanic. 
Judaism is satanic. I say, show me it's not. I'll show you it is. That's my line first. Done? Okay, fantastic. Two All right. Two minutes or three minutes? That was two minutes. Point. Two minutes, all right. Okay. Um, I'm not going to ramble. I'm going to be straight to the point. Um, I was told here, this man here is to challenge any Muslim today. He's just elaborated. He says it's mud, any Muslim, any Christian, um, it, it doesn't matter. He's, he's established truth. So he's making claims here, which are fantastic. I'm happy for him to make his claims as long as he can support his claims. He made a claim that religion is satanic. Um, so he's going to have to explain first of all, what does he mean by religion? Then he's going to have to explain what he means by satanic. And then he has to show how uh, Islam fits into his criteria of both religion and satanic. So for me now he's established his point. He wasn't clear about it, but I'm going to draw the point out. I'm not going to wait for him to tell me his point. He's established his point in his claims he's just made. So here's what we're here to do today. My man here is going to educate us in the, what the word religion means, what he means by satanic, and how Islam fits into this um, criteria that he gives to these particular words. That's enough for me. That's a minute. Brother, you have five minutes. Well, five minutes. Uh, just give me one second. I, I just want to load this up. And this is what I do sometimes. I don't, you know, put all the things together. But since I got five minutes, breathe in, breathe out, because you're going to need every breath you can get for these things you need to hear. All right? So just give me a second. Just give me a second, I beg you, just to get this done. Yeah? As it is, as it is, in the past, when I was a Christian, I had issues with Christianity and I had issues with Islam. Everyone knows what that means, right? And it was always a fight between the two, as it is a fight in the world stage today. But anyway, Long story short, there's a reason why I realized I had to get out of Christianity because I found out it was a lie. But because we're born into lies, we acquiesce to lies. We start living a lie. Whatever culture you're born into, that's what you know. It's hard to change what you've learned all your life as truth. Then it was Christianity against Islam. Oh, did Muhammad do this? Oh, did Jesus that? Oh, we believe in Jesus too, but he's only at this. Oh, we believe in Muhammad, but we... And you just go on and but guess what? Whilst 80 to 90% of the world's religious population is in those two religions, in one way or the other, one form or the other, did you know we're all in a lie? We're living a lie? There's only those two players. And I say, this is a statement you need to write down. When you do not know what the game is, when you don't know what the game is, you can't understand what the players are doing. When you don't know what the game is, if you've never watched baseball, and you see people swinging sticks and running around a, a course, you don't know what they're doing. You don't know what the game is. When you see a player, you don't know what he's doing. So the players right now are Islam and Christianity and all the other religions. But you don't know what they're doing. So you're part of it. Question number one is, before we go on to establish that they're satanic, and we'll give you evidence and give you proof and give you the education. Question number one is, out of 100% of the population of Muslims, how many of them actually investigated it before they joined it? I'm not saying read about it. I'm saying investigate it before you join it. What's the population of those who were just born into it, who are now the proselytizers of it? I.e. you were born into a market and you promote the market you're born into. Do you ever come out of that market and look at it and say, boy, what am I selling here? Christian is the same. You're born into it, nominally Christian. Did you ever investigate it? I'm not saying read about it in the Bible. Muslims like to say, whatever you want to know about Islam, open the Quran. I say, that's not how you do it. You go to America and they say there's racism. 
You accuse them of racism and they say, no, there's no racism. I say, yes, there is. They say, no, there isn't. And they say, prove to me. And I say, well, 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 they say, hey, come here. Check in the constitution if you see us being racist. It's apparently it's a debate. In the constitution. Five minutes each, but this five now, minutes each ain't gonna work. Can you see inside the constitution of America? Hello. Five minutes Can you too long. see them being racist inside the constitution? No. Can you see them being unjust inside the constitution? No. Can you see them being wicked to poor people inside the constitution? No. So how are you going to go into the Quran and find that it's satanic? How are you going to go into the Bible and the Bible is going to tell you we have worshipped Satan? You don't go by what they say. You go by what they do. You go by what you see them doing. You don't look at the politicians and just listen to what they say, as we've been deceived to just listen to them. Four years intervals, they come and lie to us again, and we follow them again. That's why they almost force us to follow them. So they can say, you voted for us. You voted for religions now, and you voted to lose your soul. You haven't investigated the religions you're in, and we're here about to teach you why you should. I'm going to be honest with you, yeah, this this idea of allowing him to speak for more than two minutes is not going to work. Um, he's, he's got an agenda and he's rambling that agenda. And I don't work that way. I'm not here to stand on a ladder and preach my bit and he preaches it and I preach my bit, yeah. I've not got a pen and paper here to record all the points he's making, yeah. I ain't here to do that. I'm here to debate. You want to debate, we debate. We ask questions, we answer questions. Simple as that. I'm not interested in monologues. Re I really am not. Okay. First thing, I mean, I can't remember what half the things he said. He's talking about politics, America. Okay. First thing, you, you're talking to a revert Muslim. So if you want to talk to somebody who was born in a market, stepped out of that market and then looked at that market was and such, yeah, you, I'm here. So if you think you're talking to a Pakistani Muslim who grew up in a mosque all his life, you know, yeah? I'm an Englishman, I grew up, um, brought a probably atheist, embraced Islam 15 years ago, after what? Intellectual investigation. Now, you, so first of all, I'm not your target. So your whole point about step being born that way, not thinking about it, just accepting it, I'm the wrong guy. Yeah, that's the first point. And the second point, why do we say, look at the Qur'an? Why, why do we say, open the Qur'an? Because we as Muslims believe in our paradigm that the Qur'an is the word of our Creator. And we believe that that's where we get our guidance from our Creator. Yeah, the miracles of uh, Moses was magic and illusion and the people believe once they realized his magic and illusion had surpassed that of the uh, magicians um, of the Pharaoh. Yeah, uh, Jesus, his, um, his miracles was uh, healing. He used to cure the leper and uh, the, cure the lame, raise the dead and such through the power of God, obviously. That was his miracle. And that was for the people of his time to realize he was who he claimed to be. Now today, there are people who will do the miracles of Jesus. I watched a TV program where someone did all the miracles of Jesus. They walked on water. They didn't just turn water to wine. They turned it to coffee. They turned it to vodka. They turned it to orange juice. So th these parlor tricks don't work anymore. Now when the time of the Prophet Muhammad وسلم, and in the pagan Arabia where they worshipped idols in the Kaaba, what was, what, what was the miracle given to him to convince the people that he was who he claimed to be? Because magic and illusion was not the thing at the time, it was poetry. So he was given the Qur'an to recite to the people. Now, the people of Arabia who worship idols and statues, what did they respond with when he came with this? They said, the guy's mad. He's crazy. But when they, when they heard the words of the Qur'an, they realized this, this was no um, words of a crazy man. So then they responded with, he's a liar. He's pretending he's having revelations. And then they realized that He's not a liar. Why? Because for 40 years we knew him as Alamin, the truthful one. The one who could be trusted. The one when we went on a journey, we left our, uh, our possessions with him because we knew he'd take care of them and return them on our return. This is the man we trust. This is the man we, we got to arbitrate between our tribes when we've disputed a matter. So he can't be a liar. It doesn't go against it. It goes against his very nature. And what did the poets say? The poets who were sent to investigate Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the Qur'an, what did they respond with when they, when they were asked, what is it then? If he's not mad and he's not a liar, what is it? Where does he get these words? They said it's magic. How can poets 
in literature who've gone to investigate a poet, the poetry of the Quran, how can they come to that conclusion? What did they see in the Quran 1400 years ago that for them they were convinced this is supernatural? Now, if you want to challenge the supernatural aspect, Alhamdulillah, yeah, there's three candidates, the atheists here poncing about, yeah? They claim Muhammad wrote it. Or you get the Christians who try to claim, this is the weak, naive Christians, that I must add, they try to say, oh, Satan is the author of the Quran. And then you've got the ones like Jay Smith who know they can't say that because it goes against their very teachings of Jesus in their Bible. So they'll say man wrote it and then they'll try and have their cake and eat it. They'll say, well, Muhammad did it. And then they'll say, Uthman burned it. And then they'll say, no, it's put together 300 years later. So they, they try to have their cake and eat it. Yeah. But the reality here is this. Yeah? The Quran was revealed 1400 years ago. The people who was revealed to the Arabs in their language, they thought it was magic and supernatural. Now you claim the Quran is satanic. So here's your first point you have to prove now. You need to prove to everybody here today that the Quran is satanic. And like I said to you earlier, you need to understand what satanic means. And then you have to apply your uh, criteria for satanic to the Quran. Yes, look, he's got pen and paper, man. I didn't tell me about pen and paper. <laughs> so he's got to now prove to us how the Quran is satanic. Now, and then he has to show us how religion is satanic. I can't remember half the things he rambled on about, I'll be honest with you. Cut the time down, please. There's no need for five minutes, yeah? I don't like this format. I like to back and forth. I think we open it up after this, This, yeah? Crossfire comes after. Um, first thing I, I'm going to say in this section is, Most of the people who come here in this so-called religious arena right now, they come to speak about religion. I come to speak about, just for the camera, just because this is important. I come to speak about truth. I come to speak about truth. They're here for religion. I'm here for truth. Put this in your head. Embed this on your hard drive. Embed it there. Seal it there. You're here for this. You're here for that. To defend that. That's what you're here to do. Defend religion. But any, any fool can see that religion is like politics and we'll go there we're fully loaded sometimes we're so fully loaded we have nowhere to unload there's no arena where I can unload all truth that we have to unload there's just no loading bay that's enough for it so there's not even enough time the little we can will do. Section two of this little of this little paragraph. The brother here is already copping out. He's vomiting blood. He's bleeding slowly. He needs to escape. I permit him to leave. This is way, way too much for him. He wants to talk about religion and the Quran. All right? That's all he wants to talk about. The religion and the Quran. And he said in his own words, maybe my knowledge, he doesn't have it. And I'll help him. My knowledge, you don't have 1% of it. So I can let you leave, if that's what you're asking. If you're asking, can I leave? I'm saying, brother, you can leave. I'm your brother, and we can still talk outside. 30 seconds. Because this is in front of the camera. I'm here to speak about truth, and we're going to use religion to show what is truth and what is false. Thank you. Let's open it up now. No, no, let me do my little three bit, then we'll open it up. Okay, because uh, he says some nonsense then. Okay. Uh, f first thing, first thing, right? Why did I speak about religion and Islam? Because he brought it up. Why did I speak about the Quran? Because he brought it up. Now he's trying to create this fallacy that I brought, changed the subject, I tried to escape. Okay. Second thing, who 
here thinks I'm trying to escape here? And who keeps trying to tell me to leave till I, so I leave him alone? I think this is the one you want to get rid of me. Yeah, because you're going to get dealt with. Okay. Second thing. Third thing, sorry. You keep going on about truth. Who defines truth? Is it your criteria for truth we have to go by? And if it is your criteria for truth, can you tell me what that criteria is and how we have to fit in with it and why your truth is better than everyone else's truth? Yeah? And I'm not here to talk about religion. I'm not here in the park here talking about religion. I'm an Englishman. This is my country. My country's going down the toilet. There's five poisons destroying my society. And Islam protects my society from those poisons. The people leading my society right now are encouraging those five poisons. But Islam prohibits it. So inshallah, if one of my English brethren can hear an Englishman speaking in this manner about Islam, about this religion of Arabs and camels and all of these things, and this religion of misogyny and oppression and such like this, and they can actually relate it to their daily life, and they can improve their daily life, then alhamdulillah the job is done. But right now, right now, you have made claims and I want you to support those claims or take back the claims. You said Islam is satanic. So I wish you, please don't put Islam with religion. I beg you of that. Because religion, if you say religion, we're talking about Hinduism, we're talking about Sikhism, we're talking about Buddhism, we're talking about all sorts of isms. I'm not interested. I'm here to talk about Islam. I'm not here to defend religion. I'm here to defend a way of life which is Islam, that if everybody adopted it as their way of life, inshallah, this world will be a much, much, much better place. And anyone who wants to challenge that concept, feel free after this debate to take me aside, we'll put it on film and we'll challenge it, yeah? Islam is the only thing that can save England from herself. The only thing. Anyway, now you define satanic religion and how Islam fits that criteria. And also, don't forget, we want to know what truth is according to your definition and why we should accept your definition. All right, without timing any... Sorry, you finish, I guess, right? Without timing anyone, because he said he wants this open... No, it's open. Now, but can we maybe have some rules for the openness, or is it just anyhow? I will interrupt if you don't address what I've just said. See why I'm writing your points down? Good. So let's first define truth. I, I'm gonna let's start with truth. We're dealing with the situation scientifically. Let's deal with your claims. Truth. Now, we'll do one thing if we, if we agree on that. Okay, do not um, overbear on me to answer you the way you want. When you ask a question, let me answer. If you ramble, I will interrupt. Well, that's fine. But if I ask you a question, you'll see I'll let you answer. Because I'll answer it. Okay, I won't disturb you while you're answering. If I have another question while you're answering, I'll raise my hand. I might need the time to correct what you heard me say. I might need sometimes to do that. But that's not trying to stop you from... Asking. No problem, no problem. I'm okay. with that. Define so, truth. Some of the points you made um, is this. Who defines truth? Who no, I said, what is truth and who defines it? Look, I wrote it down, so your words are just clear. What is truth and who defines it, you, I said? You can ask whatever you want, but... So answer it. Now, I write them down because... the. But write down what I said. Don't write down what you thought I said. Yeah, because I told you. You start rambling, you start going off what I said, I'm going to correct you. And I'll say it again to you. My question to you was very, very simple. What is truth? And who defines it? And why should we accept that definition as the only understanding of the word truth? Okay. What is truth? Yes. Okay. Here we go. Before I answer this one, just to let you know my background, because a lot of people are going to say, well, who is he, what is he? We don't mind about that. We're going to accept you know. He's stopping me again. Right. Because you know why? I have to pray soon, yeah? And you're rambling. So answer the questions, please. Is there anyone here? We don't need to know your background. You did a 20-minute introduction. Just answer the questions, please. You are waiting. What do does you he say? Do you we want to know what truth is. Yes, tell us. Can I answer? You ask a question. Answer it then. Can I actually speak? Yes, answer it then. Then can you keep shut? Well, answer the question then. What does he say there, why, why do you have to speak when I'm speaking? Is there any fair game person here? Answer the Yeah, but then keep shut while I answer. What was the question? And then answer it. I haven't understand nothing here, man. I want to know what the point is. 
I know why you don't understand nothing, because you're... No, Muslim. don't, don't, no, 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 no. <laughs> Like the brother, like the brother said. Oh, man, you're being rude now, mate. Like the, what? Come on, man. Calling you a Muslim is rude? No, no. What, listen, what don't, about listen don't distract him. What He's got to concentrate on his notepad. Yeah, it's it's the, the the don't distract, bro, bro. I've been distract coming him. here. Yeah, both sides. Don't distract him. I've been coming here a long time enough. Yeah. It's like you haven't seen me for a couple Same of here, years. I've been coming here years But you ain't never taught anything here. All right. Yeah, show me your work. In fact, the way, that's why I don't call this a debate. I debate with people who have a body of work. Show me your work. You got no body of work. You're just talking. So now you're trying to escape the debate again. What debate? We ain't debating with. So what are we doing then? Discussion. All right, alhamdulillah. Can you answer the question then? Let me speak when you ask a question. Answer it then. That's you say you're an Englishman. That's how they do down in Parliament. You ask the question. Have you ever seen Prime Minister's question times? Let the man speak. And just stop changing subject. What is? Well, you mentioned Parliament. Stop saying I'm changing subjects. What is truth? Is your question the first question? Yes. Truth. Finally. See now here we go again. Truth is the establishment of the word of the Creator in instruction given to man. Clear. Good point. Good point. Is that clear? You heard it. And who defines that? We just said it right there in the... No, no, no. Right there in the definition. No, who defined that? The creator. Defines it? Yeah. Okay. Is I, agree, right? I agree with that. Yeah, okay. okay. Second question I've answered just now. Who defines it, right? Yeah, with you. So that was, that was easy, wasn't it? Alhamdulillah. He wants a fight over that. <laughs> no. Because he loves confusion. I'm not arguing with you. See how he, how he shut down? He shut down now because the answer was simple. <laughs> no, because your answer agrees now, with what I believe. Ask you a question. Or do you have any more questions? No, I, uh, where'd you get the definition from? The definition is from the word of the Creator. And what's that word? It's in the Torah. Oh, right, right, right. Are you one of those uh, Hebrews? Black Hebrews? Is that what I'm in the that's debate why, with there? See, that's why I like doing the things. Yeah, you, okay. You, I get you. Can, it's your question, can I answer, yeah? Huh? I do the yeah, things yeah, 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 yeah. ahead of the, ahead of his. Can question. you look, 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 look? Just so we know, because this is not fair. This now, because you know me, I don't know you. You've watched my videos. I've never seen you in my life, right? Well, I believe I'm a Muslim. You've already heard me say that I believe Islam is the only thing that can save England from herself. I believe that Islam is a fantastic way of life for everybody. Yeah, I chose this way of life for myself. No one put a sword to my throat telling me I have to convert or die. I'm a Muslim. Alhamdulillah. I bear witness to the oneness of God, and I bear witness to the Muhammad Sallallahu was his messenger, and all of the prophets: Jesus, Moses, Abraham, Jacob all the tribes Adam Noor all of the tribe this is my belief alhamdulillah this is what I believe now can you tell us what you believe uh, 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 you see that because we walk ahead of time when we say we know them not because I had a meal with him <laughs> but we know their spirit and we know how they how they live I want to introduce myself and this yeah, question yeah. would have been like behind that is a fair already. question so what do you believe tell this people what you believe been behind already tell us with people what you believe then I yeah you, you had five minutes and five minutes you never told us what you believe so tell us now I am of the children of Israel that your book so-called talks about when you say the children of Israel in the Quran, there must be a people that refers to. And more time than number, it tells you, talk to them, speak to them, ask questions of them, check their book. Okay? And that's one of the things we're going to raise. That's why I wanted heavyweight Muslims right here. I've got a lightweight with me. He can't deal with these issues because with the heavyweights, they already, we'd be, we be up there right now. We'd be up there right now. They send in the lightweight for a reconnaissance. <laughs> it's called a reconnaissance, intellectual reconnaissance. He'll come, gather info from what I said, and go and give the heavyweights. The heavyweights will study it and see how to come back to me. If they can come back to me. But the lightweight is making good of the time because through the lightweight we can reach people. Point, so I'm a child of Israel. As your book says, as the Quran says. Quran says what? The Quran tells you about the children of Israel. Right, isn't it? Yeah, right. And their scripture. What's your point? And then Islam says that we believe in the prophets. Right. And there we're going. So we draw a line quickly. Right. And we say Islam says 
we believe in the prophets. Right. And I say, which prophets? And that's just a quick question to you. Which prophets? And what of what nation are those prophets? That's a question to you. We believe in Prophet Noah, Abraham, Jacob, the tribes, Ismaq, Ishaq, Ismail, Moses, Jesus, Muhammad Sasan, all of them. We make no distinction between them. What nation are all those prophets from? <laughs> um, I have no idea. Tell me. Can you see that? I'm going to ask again. Is the camera on here? What nations, all oh Muslims, are those prophets that brother... What's your name again? Sorry. What nation are those prophets from? All the prophets that you've mentioned in the Quran, what nation are they from? Okay. All Simple right. question. Okay. Um, Noah, um, we don't know. Maybe Adam. Uh, I, I would say Abraham. Well, we again, we don't know. Um, Ismail, obviously, um, from Abraham. Uh, Isaac is from Abraham. Jacob and the tribes is from Abraham. Um, Moses, Jesus, Abraham. And uh, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Abraham. Next question. Is that it? Was that all the prophets I mentioned? It's all right. Okay, let's go to the topmost one. What nation was Jesus from? What nation? What nation? Um, You've said Abraham. You're in English. Man. Abraham. I'm asking again, just in case the camera ain't picking it up. You're just being patronizing. Just get to the no, point. No, 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 no. He's asking me a question. What was the nation of Jesus? Abraham. What's your point? Okay, so. Did they not say, uh, uh, just, just before we go there, where did you see, in which records were you able to gather the information that Jesus is from the nation of Abraham? From what records were you able to gather that information? Uh, the Quran. The Quran? Yeah. Right. What was the religion of Abraham, by the way? Oh, tell me no. all the religion of Abraham was. I don't want the... What's the nation of Abraham? Tell me, tell me. You seem, you seem to imply that all the prophets came from one nation. So what nation did Abraham come from? Just for the camera, I don't do um, confusion. Let's take things step by step. Oh, well, sorry, sorry. You asked me where the prophets came from. I'm asking you. Yeah. Can I, oh, can I not ask you a question? Sorry, I, I, have, you got, have you got copyright on your questions? I'm no, asking you. Absolutely not. So answer the question then. When we've dealt with the first one. When we've dealt with the first question. I don't run All right, you asked me, where do no, we get... You don't need to repeat what I asked you. Everybody heard it. Let's not waste time with repetition. Right. Right? we asking, and you've answered some. The Quran, I said. And we say, where do the prophets you call Jesus of what nation is he? There's a name of his nation. Because we mentioned that in the opening of this section. The children of Israel. Suddenly, I'm not hearing that Israel anymore. So Jesus, was Jesus an Israelite? That's the question to you. Was Jesus an Israelite? Was Jesus from the tribe of Jacob? Yes. So that makes Jesus an Israelite, right? That's why yes. the Quran likes to refer to the children of Israel. Okay. So, brother, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to answer your question. Go on. Before we go there, can you mention other prophets that you've mentioned that are from the nation of Israel? Can you mention Can that? I, you want me to name other prophets? Yeah, that whatever you remember. That, it's, not, it's not an examination. Right, so you whatever want... you know, you say. If you right. don't know, it's all right. Right, so you want me to, from the Quran, the, the prophets that uh, descended from the tribes of Jacob, yeah? yeah. So from Israel, not from Jacob. Israel. Israel is Jacob. Well, mention it then. I just, we said Israel because there's a reason for that. Well, you, uh, is Israel Jacob or not? Are you asking about blood descendants no, or what? No, we're not arguing. Jacob is Israel, yes. Right, Israel so and Jacob are the same, yes? Israel is his surname. So a descendant, and we go right. By surname. right? Right, right, so right. right. So, so use that surname. No, it's not his surname. It's not a surname at all. Where'd you get that from? It was his surname. It is, you see, that's why I said you need that. Okay, anyway. You're asking me who are the descendants. But just answer the what question. What are you talking about? You know. You're talking over me now. You're complaining about talking over you. No, 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 no. What did you say? 
I don't expect me to answer the question the way you want me to answer it. Did you not say that? I didn't say you must. No, no. You said I shouldn't expect you to answer the question I want you to. I did say Right. So don't expect me to answer the question you want me to either. I'm not expecting... So don't have double standards. Be consistent. No. All right. So you asked me who, which prophets are from the descendants of Jacob and I the... I did not say that. That's, that's the thing. I said which other prophets after Jesus that you've accepted is an Israelite which other prophets after Jesus know, listen to the question besides Jesus besides which other prophets do you know that are Israelites I didn't say descendants of Jacob well that's what an Israelite is well see now you want me to say what you want or we, you, I no no that. no not at all I'm not answering the question you want me to I'll answer the question or I choose to answer the question. Whether you accept that que answer, you can challenge that after. But challenge I'm going to answer what? my we're, answer. We're challenging. Right, anyway. So I'm saying we're it again. Teaching. I'm saying it again to you. Jacob, just so everyone knows here, Jacob had four wives. Two wives and their slaves. These were his four wives. And the 12 tribes of Israel descend from these four wives. Okay? Now, according to the Bible, God says don't make distinction between slaves and uh, your true wives. A wife you hate and a wife you love. The rights of the firstborn is the rights of the firstborn. So, this is Jacob. Four wives and all the tribes, the 12 tribes, descend from Jacob. Now, some tribes, like Levi, for example, we get uh, Moses, uh, Harun, and uh, Mary, mother of Jesus. Um, from other lineages, we'll get um, Moses, not Moses, sorry, it was just Moses, isn't it? Uh, Solomon, Daniel, David, from the tribe of Judah. So Judah, we'll get David, and we'll get other prophets descended from that. So I, I'm not a biblical expert, I can only refer to the Quran. Yeah, and from what I know from the Quran, Ismail was from Ibrahim, and uh, Ishmael um, came from, um, sorry, Isaac came from Ibrahim also. Jacob, Yaqub came from Isaac, and then the 12 tribes came from that, and then obviously we have Moses and all the prophets we know down to Jesus. And then obviously Muhammad was uh, away from that from the tribe of Ismail. Look, I'm not going to berate you on what you don't know. There's a lot that I know. What did I say then was wrong? The day, I'm just, it's my time to talk. I'm just trying to talk. No, I want to challenge you challenging what I just said. I want you to tell me why. Don't just make a statement and don't back it up. Did I say what you said is wrong? Yeah, you just said I, you're going to accept how you don't know. So you, you're assuming what I just said was wrong. Who said, when did I say that? What do you mean by then I don't know? This is, this is a problem. You're not using the words I use. You just said that. Can I say what I said again? Say what you like. You can hear it. Okay? All right, say what you like. I'm not... Do you accept what I just said is true or not, first of all? Is it true or not? Look, I ain't your wife, okay? I don't need to accept nothing. <sighs> Let me just speak. You speak yours. All right. I'm not all digging right. into you. All right. Yeah? I ain't Sarah. I'm not digging into you, all right? So listen to this, yeah? I'm not berating you for what you do not know or what you don't remember. That you can't remember something don't mean you don't know it. So don't try to quote it. It's not, it's not, that's not the important thing. What I asked you was, are there any other prophets from the nation of Israel that you know from your Quran? That's all I asked you. If you do, say yes. If you don't, say no. Please mention. So I give you a full history. Okay. So all the prophets, just for your information, all the prophets you've named up to, up to, um, uh, to Jesus, they're all Israelites. Except Ishmael. Obviously, everybody knows Ishmael ain't no, ain't no prophet. You don't believe he's a prophet? What's a mask got belief got to do with anything? Well, what do you mean? Everybody believes what they want. We're tracing so facts. No, 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 it doesn't mean that. Belief doesn't mean what you just said. So now, don't, don't, start, don't start trying to do a Sarah's on me now, please. Now, look. Belief doesn't mean what you just said it does. So don't try and throw ahead red herrings out there. You yeah? Want a, you want a does the Quran claim Ismail is a, um, a prophet or not? Does the Quran claim it or not? Okay. No, does the Quran claim it or not? For you Muslims, you believe. Right, 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 right. That's, now, what did, what did you. No, no, no. It's all right. So, what. No, 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 relax a second. Look, look, what did you say to me? No, no, no. You asked me where do I get my information from? I told you the Quran. All right, that's my source of information. And my source of information also tells me Ismail was a prophet. Simple. Let me, let me just, uh, let me move on. Let me move on. We, we won't go into the believe and belief thing. People believe whatever they want. I'm not here to stop you believing in anything. Like I said, I'm here to establish truth. I ain't here to establish or chat about religion. That's your, that's your mindset. Why you cannot handle this thing it's because you're here for that. Why? 
you know I'm here for that. Inside that, I think, I'm sorry, I've already climbed. No, 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 you're not going to misquote me. You're telling people here that I came about religion. I told everyone here clearly why I'm here. It's not what you said. So please stop with the red herrings. What is the truth? I agreed with, I'm here to establish truth. And now he's acting like I'm not here to establish truth. He puts Quran on one side, truth on one side. So truth He's writing the things and telling me what I'm here to do. And I've told him straight that's not. I've been waiting half an hour, still want another. Yeah, he has point. No, no, his point. Look, we know, we know his stance now. He's a black Hebrew. Yeah. He believes that Israelites were all black. Yeah. Yeah. And he believes that when the Jesus comes, all the white people are going to be enslaved by the black people. We know what he believes. Yeah. And we're going to drag it out of him. Yeah. Yeah, we're all going to be your slaves, right, isn't it, according are, to what you are, believe? These are, these are... Anyway, carry on. These are naive in assumptions that he's made. Well, we'll see, isn't it? Can I, can I speak You now? can. There's, there's but don't misrepresent me, please. Don't show a piece of paper to the people it's saying this is what he's here to do when I've clarified I'm not here to do that. Please, all right? That's all I ask. Be intellectually honest. Sir, uh, excuse me, Mr. Speaker. There are people, they are keep telling that Jesus was a black man. No, no, no. But brother, brother, relax. Don't worry about it. It doesn't matter if Jesus was black, Chinese or white. It's irrelevant. No, but that's a black super It's irrelevant. Supremacy. It's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. You done? Just don't misrepresent me or I'll interrupt again. Well, you can interrupt, but don't make it too long. I can get, I can Good. get back on the track you want. To. Good, just don't yeah. misrepresent me. Well, don't start a preaching off that, okay? But don't misrepresent me then. I am misrepresenting Yes, you did. I told you why I was here, I'm and you misrepresented me. Look, I'm speaking one to you, and two to the bigger picture, which is religion. And but I told you don't associate. No, no, no. I told you don't do that. If you want to speak to a Hindu, speak to a Hindu. Don't speak, don't categorize me with religion, please. Don't do that. I told you not to do that. Okay. Maybe let's make this for the record so we can we can deal with him specifically. Thank you. Deal with Islam specifically. Islam or you? Islamically. Islam. No, no, which one is it? I, I've got to deal with you or deal with Islam? What did I say? So are you, what did I are say? You, are you Islam? What did I say? I'm listening again. What did I say? I told so the people, why did I tell the people I was here? So what to show you? them what how Islam, Islam, not how Hamza, how Islam can change their lives for the better and can save England from herself. No, no, no. No, no, no. I'm, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Look, 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 look. That's all I'm I'm not, no, we'll you're go, misrepresenting we'll me. Preaching. We'll go to the preaching. Huh? Are you a Muslim? Yes. Are you a Muslim? Alhamdulillah. So that's all I want to ask. So what guides my understanding? I'm an Israelite. Right. No, I, I know you are. I you what guides your understanding. No, no, no. Ten minutes left. We've got ten minutes. Yeah. See? Why ten minutes? See? The time's Why ten minutes? Don't you only get five adverts in your... Uh, when you say you've got time, ten minutes left, what do you mean? Oh, you mean... SIM card. Memory card's going to run out. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, fair enough. I've got a memory. Is it micro? You have not SD card. SD. I've got SD if it, will, if it will work for you. Yeah? You can record on it if it, if it does the things that are But look, let's make this clear, concise, sharp. Yeah? That's one thing that's always been missing. Yeah? The brothers surely don't want to discuss some truth. He wants his religion to have. Truth. Right, can I stop him again? Yeah, I've just, yeah. for the fourth time now, yeah. I have not mentioned the word religion. You have, right? I said I agree to establish truth. I believe Islam is that truth. If you want to challenge my understanding of Islam, do so. But please don't put me in the category of religion and your preconceived subjective understanding of the, such a term. Please don't do that. Don't misrepresent me, yeah? Now, can I say something? Stay on point. Can I say something, please? And I want you to hear me. You asked the question about the prophets, stay on point. Where do I get my source about the prophets? The Quran. Challenge that. Can I say something? Because say what you like. It's important that while I'm speaking, what I say is allowed to be said for the discussion we're having. As long as you don't misrepresent me. Well, you can, you, you, but don't need to interrupt me since I've done it two times. Well, if you do, I'll do it for the fifth time. You see, what he's trying to stop is the statement of fact. Now, what I'm trying to do is keep you on point and to stop you misrepresenting me. You keeping me on. You, you, you're preaching red herrings. I'm you're preaching straw keep, men. I'm not here to keep stay on point. You asked about the Quran. Why have you switched topic? Why have you gone away from what was the nations of the prophets and all of this? Stay on point. Does not. Does nobody want to know if Islam is truth or not? Yes, I do. So, no, besides, besides Muslims... No, I want to know why you think it's not. Well, we're going to go there, but let me speak. Go there then. That's why, you do, that's why we said ten minute, the 10-minute law was better. 
Because no, no, Islam, you ramble, what man. It's what they do in Islam. Everybody shouting. No, 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 no. You're shouting over me, mate. This is the practice. We're seeing it now. Brother. If it's not so, then let it be changed. Say again. You keep saying, let me speak. And you're speaking. Yeah, but if you hear me, if you hear what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold People on. are going to walk away soon, Hold on. Brothers. I don't Seriously. mind. I really don't mind. Because, like, everyone's patience is getting, like... Look, is anyone forced to be here? No, no, no. No, of so don't I worry about... I what the truth is, mate. No. What is truth? It will take the time that, this, that the, the man in the ring allows the, the, the thing to go. <laughs> if he want it, if he want the thing to come out proper, okay, but you it will come out proper. Not anything, That's it. Okay. Not if he misrepresents me, no. You see the problem? But how will we ever morning. speak if when you start no, speaking, you anyway. I say you So what? It stays on point. Me. How will you speak? I'm not interested in straw men or red herrings, yeah? Stay on point. He asked me a question about how, where, who were the nation, uh, which um, prophets came from the nation of Israel, yeah? Uh, so I, I elaborated on who the nation of Israel were, Jacob, the four wives, the twelve tribes, who did say, Levi was uh, Moses and such, and David came from Judah, uh, yeah? yeah? Right? And then, I, and then I said, Ismail um, came from Ibrahim and was also a prophet. He asked me where to get my information from. I said the Quran. He then turns around and says, Ismail's not a prophet. Well, the Quran says he is. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. I'm sorry? Oh, okay. No, bro, bro, bro. Do me one favor. What sorry, 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 sorry. Do, sorry? Make you go into religion. All right. I don't want to go no, there first. No, no, no. We're going into. You ask questions about the prophets. No, no, no. Don't get into that. Don't get into that. Don't get into that. I know about the Quran. Hold on, brother, brother. I tell you what. I tell you what. If I show you a verse in the Quran, where it's no, no, no. I'm just gonna come No, no, no. You see that? That's called the baby. One second, second. For the benefits of the camera, point the camera on him. Yeah. He's next. Alone. He's next. Excuse me, bro. Do me a serious favor. I want to hear this debate. Thank you. Thank you. I can't force you, but don't let him drag you into. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? It's okay. fine. Look, when we when we were in school, well, he's a Christian. He's a Christian. He was a Muslim, became a Christian. When we were in school, let he's in more confusion than you. So, let me speak so we can answer him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Speak, speak yeah. now. Okay, speak. so so he's supposed to speak. Now I'm, I'm here yeah. to speak about truth. Yeah. He can say that he's here to do the same. Thing. Allah Akbar. But we're gonna check. We're gonna check. That. Alhamdulillah. Okay, that's what we're here to check. Yeah. If he says he's here to speak about truth, Alhamdulillah. Then we'll leave religion. Alhamdulillah. Now, wicked, now wicked. hear us, guys. I'm an atheist. Now we have progress. Brothers, are we here? I want to hear this. Are we man. divided already? Everyone, be quiet. Are we here? We could do the atheist after. <laughs> you first, and you're second. We'll put that to the test. Are you ready? Come and support you. Now, Anas, 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 Anas. We're going to deal with the atheists. Come. Oh, he's running. He's running. Wait, wait, wait. For, for the benefit of the camera, I'm strutting. <laughs> Showing pictures of a white Jesus. Uh, he's, like, he's preaching. He's just giving him a ladder. Now, now listen. Are you? Are you? Are you? Happy? Yes. Yeah. Or you want to run too? I'm happy. Then, then just keep calm. I want to run. Then keep calm. Keep calm. Hello, mate. All right. Man-made stories. Yeah. You can see. You can see. Not yet, mate. You can see the person behind you. You can see the person behind you. Look. We'll test your intellectual. We'll, we'll test it. You can see we'll test it. Behind you we'll test it. Well, you always point at truth as being. We'll put your name in lights. Now, test it. Now, now, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. They say, they say their religion is truth. Christianity says that. Islam says that. I am truth, and I've come to disprove them. Okay. Christianity will do that on another time because there's no Christian here for that. Why are we speaking with this man? I can take them both on at the same time. He's just Why by himself. Why are you so arrogant? Right Why are you so arrogant? Arrogant? Shit. Bro, bro, bro. Excuse me, excuse me. Hold on. Right. right. What's the problem? It's not. It's arrogance. It's arrogant. Arrogance is not a crime. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. That's how you know you don't know anything. Arrogance. People don't listen to people. Arrogance is a sin. Now you least stop. Now you stop being a moderator. Huh? Have you stopped? I'm, 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 I'm just saying here. Leave I'm not leave doing it. So you're not doing the timing. Tell the camera. You're, you're okay. Okay. You can see what the geese is up to. So we're going to go cut. We know what this geese is all about. Yeah. All right. You're getting into the argument.
argument. Are you, are you, who, which one are you? Are you a Christian or a Christian? Time's finished. Bro, don't finished. worry about him. Okay, let him speak then. Do me, one, do me one favor. Oh, wait there, wait there. Wait there, he wants to continue. Do you know what? I come all the way from Kent, man, every Sunday to come see this. <laughs> and I feel Why I'm going to die now because anyone who don't want what they're hearing, they can always. Nobody's forced to be anywhere. No one's forced to be anywhere. Stop flattering. Why are you showing people pictures of a white Jesus? I don't get it. All right, go, go. I don't understand your point. I'm, no, not, I'm this, not doing this, this timekeeping is not, nonsense. This is not a white Jesus. No. This ain't white What's he doing? This doesn't seem to be working. Now, either. let's start again. Let's no, start no, no, no. Let's go back to the point you made. Stop touching my stuff. Let's go back to the point you made. Let's go back to the point you made. You asked me the question about the prophet. Why are you not sticking to Callum, that? Tell him! Tell him, bro! You, you left the thing! I don't know oh, why you left the Now listen! Can we still do the talk or not? I want to debate with you! Can we do the talk or not? I'm an atheist! No way, yeah? Okay, now listen to this, yeah? All religions say they're truth! All religions say they're truth! And that's what we've come to test! Since they deny when we say they're here for religion! They say they're here for truth! So let's check truth! Now, He's a Muslim. Hamza, I believe your name is. You're a Muslim. Is there any truth in the Quran that links to the earlier truth from the Torah? Are you referring to the Torah in the Bible, you mean? Yeah, the Bible, yeah. I'm not sure. I wouldn't, I'll be honest with you, you're asking me to qualify the Quran, which is true, with a book that uh, is right. spurious. Okay, so I don't fair know. enough, fair enough. Now, you mentioned Abraham as a prophet. Yes. You mentioned Moses as a prophet. And then some Muslims, some Muslims will say that Moses was a Muslim. In fact, they say Jesus was a Muslim. I say Abraham is a Muslim. Then they say Abraham was a Muslim. Yes. The common denominator is with the Jews. Now I say to them, what Islam tries to do is launch part themselves of our scriptures. <coughs> when I say our scriptures, Israelite scriptures. Everybody wants to launch their religion of our intelligence. All right? Now Islam comes and says, Moses was a Muslim. I say, show me where Moses was kissing that stone. Oh, okay. Now I understand your confusion. Show Fair me enough. where Moses was. What's a Muslim? Let me finish. How do you understand? Let me finish. Right, right. Let me finish. Go on, go on. Let me finish. Go on. <laughs> Show me where Abraham is going around the Kaaba or into the Kaaba. Show me oh, God. Where, where Abraham or any of the prophets that you mention in the Bible are taking Hajj to Mecca. Show me where they call the Creator Allah. <laughs> Show me where they recognize a prophet from the lineage of Ishmael. Are you going to entertain this nonsense? Yes. Show me those things. Okay. Are you ready? Do you know what Islam means? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Yeah, relax. 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 Are you finished? Finished? Well, we're starting. Go ahead. If all right, you, all right. Yeah, your time. All right. Like I just interrupted earlier, forgive me. Um, now I understand your confusion. All right, because when you, and I, I did say this earlier, when you say Islam, you start thinking of camels and deserts and such and such and such, all right. <laughs> First thing you have to understand, Islam purely simply means submission and surrender to God. This is what Islam means. Okay, now in English, when you do an action, so let's say you walk, you put ER at the end of the word to show you're doing the action. So you're a, if you walk, you're a walker. If you work, you're a worker. In Arabic, if you do the action, you put mu in front of the word. So for example, if you do salah, which is prayer, you're a musalla. If you do the adhan, you're the mu'adhin. If you do Islam, you're a mu'islam, or Muslim. So the one who submits and surrenders their will to God in total obedience and sincerity and peace, that's what a Muslim is, the one who does Islam. Now, when we say Abraham was a Muslim, why do we say Abraham was a Muslim? Do we make the claim? Now, this is your straw man fallacy. This is your red herrings you're throwing out there. Stop with the logical fallacies, yeah? We don't claim that Abraham went to the Kaaba. Yeah? We don't say, you to be a Muslim, you have to go to the Kaaba, you have to pray five times a day. We don't say these things. We say, to be a Muslim, you need to surrender your will to God Almighty. 
And what did all of the prophets teach? La ilaha illallah. God is one and worship him. Moses taught it. Jesus taught it. Abraham taught it. All of the prophets taught the same thing. So when we say Moses was a Muslim, we say Moses surrendered his will to one God. When we say Abraham was a Muslim, we say Abraham surrendered his will to one God. We don't say they followed Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, they believed in the Quran. This is your confusion. So you need to separate your flawed understanding of the term Islam and Muslim. Because you, you've got it completely wrong. And if that is your understanding, you think to be a Muslim, it means you have to follow Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam back before Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was alive? Then you're clear, clear error. And I don't blame for the nonsense you're coming out with today now. Understand? I did Why ask did you, you if you're a Muslim before. You said you. Can I, bro? We're doing a, we're doing a, we're doing a thing here. To, 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 to an imaginary No, but I, I can't, can't, we can't. We can't hear. We can't hear. We cannot hear. He's talking to him. That's why we cannot hear. No, no. Now listen to this. Listen to this. Listen to this. Why don't you turn the camera on here so we can, the people may see the confusion? Exactly. The worry that the camera's going to be on him in a bit. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Just so, We're going to put his name in lights. Why, why I'm not talking. <laughs> now listen to this. Can somebody drag that fool away? Because he's, you know, he's breaking up something good. Everyone knows that. No, 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 leave it, leave it. Drag him away. Oh, God. You got the truth. Well, your brother is getting dragged into his nonsense. So now listen to this, yeah? Listen to this. The Quran claims to be the word of, in your words, that we've got from the camera, the Quran claims to be the word of God. Oh, sorry, sir. can I just say, I need to add one thing. I need to, yeah, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. No, I didn't address. I speak again when I want to no, 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 no. Now, Muslim brother, I can't speak. No, no, no. No, 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 listen, listen, listen. I forgot to address one point you made, not about Allah being the name of God. I forgot to address that, so I need to address that. Forget because it's not important. Well, I'm going to show how important it is. No, 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 no. Well, if it wasn't important, I wouldn't interrupt you to tell you. Anyway, so basically, uh, where does Allah come from? It sounds so foreign. God, Allah. Whoa, it sounds like camels. <laughs> basically, did you? If you, we know first thing. Jesus. Sure. Jesus didn't speak English. Yeah. Jesus didn't. You know you're going into another. No, 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 no. I'm answering the question. No, no, no. No, you did. You did. No, you did. You did. You ask. He said you did. You did. You did. You did. No, no. You asked. You asked. When did Moses call God Allah? You said when did Moses call God Allah? So I forgot to address that. Right. Right. They would. They would say one. So Allah. That's what I'm saying. Are you sincere in your questions? Are you sincere in your questions? You did. Yes, you did. You did. It's my speaking. You did. You've you interrupted did. to say one thing. Listen, then you're there's no times here. Listen, oh, that's you asked the question. You asked the question. I when did ask you no question. Did you ask me? Did I haven't finished speaking. Did you it's ask me? Rhetoric. Did you ask me? It's just, I'm just Did you ask me? Did you ask no, me? No, no. You didn't ask I'm speaking to the camera. For the purpose of the camera, no. he asked me, when did Moses call God Allah? You did ask that. So why are you lying now? You did ask that. Yes. That was previously before right. now. But what did I say? I forgot to answer. So I'm going but to answer. But that's over. You can't no. No, I'm, go I'm going to answer it. There is no time. There is no time. So if he doesn't want to hear the answer, I'll tell the answer. Okay, Allah. There we go. Jesus did not speak English. Let's understand that. When he said God, he did not say God. Jesus spoke Syriac or Aramaic. In Syriac Aramaic, it is Allah. In Hebrew, Allah. Allah, Allah, Allah. God is the strange conundrum here, not Allah. Alhamdulillah. So when Jesus called God God, he would have said Allah or Allah. Now you can carry on. Yeah, they run out. Don't worry, the camera's rolling, mate. Very cold. cold. We're not like titans, we're prepared. If you're the truth, then you should be cold. It's okay. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Anyway, um, the way the way Muslims like to talk is un un unfortunately. 
the way that societies are right now. Oh my oh, god! That's not much of a generalization. That's, oh my no, god. god! Have you not been to Dubai? Carry on, brother. We're on bike. All right, all right, all right. We've been everywhere. You've been to Malaysia. We've been everywhere. We've been to Nigeria. We, like I said, we've been we've everywhere. Been Nigeria. Anyway, anyway. Can you? Let's, 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 no, you asked me a question. Can you, you know, respond to my question? It's my time to speak. Right. You've been to Rwanda. You know, it's my time to speak. Stop speaking to the crowd. I can't even speak. No, speak. Why must you be the one to tell me how to speak? Did I do that? Why did you ask me a question and then just ignore my answer? No, you've answered it. Are you going to respond to that? That's what I want to do. But do it, you don't have to interrupt me. I'm not your mate, all right? I ain't your mate. Where's your, the camera? Where's your Christian charity then? You keep, they want to go your into jokes. I'm not your mate. No, you keep interrupting And most of you... <laughs> That's true. He interrupts himself. <laughs> I'm speaking. I'm speaking. It's still my speaking time. Yeah, but you're interrupting Everyone yourself. Can see who the clown is. Yes. yes. Yeah, we can. You're right about that. I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing. This goes out to the kingdoms of heaven. They can witness oh, what's going on. You're, you're taking glory from men laughing. It doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother me. The kingdom of heaven is witness to what's going on right now. That's what. That's all. That's important for me. If it was as important to, 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 to you as it is to me, you wouldn't be laughing. You'd hold me as your brother to look at the thing properly. But you look at it like you should laugh while I look stupid. But I say I don't mind looking stupid because truth is stupid today. Truth ain't welcome anywhere. That's a very foolish thing to do. Truth ain't welcome anywhere anymore. It is it's impacting I think we can all our daily lives and instead of us to listen to each other, we still laugh at each other. I told you. <laughs> now, you want to now subjectivize the definition of Muslim to only somebody who believes in the one God. Submit to the one God and that's it. Sorry, 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 sorry. Hi, I'm, I'm sorry. I told you, you misrepresent. No, 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 no. I said you misrepresent, you will be stopped. Okay. It is not subjective what Islam means. It's objective because that's what it means in Arabic. It's not, it's not subjective. It's not my whims and desire Islam means this. The Arabs, when they take the root word Islam and Salam and they put it all together, it's there. It's objective. Excuse me. So don't mi misrepresent. I've told you. Oh. If you misrepresent, you'll be interrupted. Okay. Does anyone does anyone have the etymology of the word Islam here? We can Google it, mate. The etymology. I'm not saying the inferred meaning. Please it, do, do. Well, Wikipedia will give you the yeah, etymology. Okay. Just, I, I ain't arguing with you. I'm just asking a question. Do you disagree with my my objective understanding? Not, see, that's your problem. See, you, all, you always feel that all the time. No, I no, 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 no. Brother, please. Okay. Please. Okay. okay. Now, now, he's. Okay, okay. Okay, here's the etymology. Okay, Arabic, Aslama. No, I want to listen, but he's speaking. It's not me. Okay, listen. Okay, should I do it for the camera? I'll do it for the purpose camera. Should I do it for the purpose camera or are you going to listen? I need to say sorry. Go away. Are you listening? Why should he go away? He's listening. No, because he's already blaming He's listening. You want to speak? I said okay. So be quiet then. Then he asked me. So be quiet. But that's the thing. Oh, you children. Right. Okay. Apologize on camera, you know, so they see what you're doing. Yes. It's fine. I've accepted it. You accepted what? Your definition. Oh, did he? So he accepted he was wrong. Fantastic. So you're going to take your what you said earlier back then? You, you see, you're interested in who's right, who is wrong. Well, that's truth. Are you not interested in the truth? Or you want to just be right? I thought you were here to establish truth. Isn't that what I've just done? So you've conceded you were wrong? You're not listening. You're, you're here to win a fight. I'm here to establish truth. No, you're not here. I am. I am. I told you I am. You think I am. No, you, you just made a lie about the understanding of the word Muslim and Islam and I corrected you with the truth. Now questions. Now you want to talk about truth? Let's see how intellectually, intellectually honest you are and concede you were wrong about the understanding of the term Islam and Muslim. We 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 asking questions. Will you are you are you ready to hear the other questions? 
Well, let's first be intellectually honest and accept you were wrong and you're... There I is a long way to go before I can say I'm wrong. Can we go that Are way? you wrong about your understanding of the word Islam? No! You're not wrong. I simply asked you what does the word mean? No, no you didn't. No, you didn't. You this said... What I, what I said, what does the word mean? Etymology. All right. Shall I, t and shall I tell I you? you? Let me tell you that. I didn't say it's wrong. Well, let me tell you. I didn't say it's right. Okay. I said, what does it mean? Okay, let's see what... It You've said it. We've heard it. Let's yeah, move on. What did I say? You, so you accept... So why ask me a question? Where did Moses go to the Kaaba? Why didn't they pray five times a day? When you know that's a complete uh, straw man red herring argument. Because you know it's, they don't have to do that. I, that's I, not Islam. I, no, do, do you want actually... Do you want to hear me or you don't want to hear me? Because at one point you wanted to run away. Now you've stayed, but you won't let Okay, me. for the benefit of the camera, I never wanted to run away. I was bored of what is rambling, yeah, and his preaching and his monologue, yeah. I'm here to debate and establish truth, which he claims. He makes false claims about the understanding of the term Islam and Muslim. When he's corrected, he doesn't concede it, yeah? He's, got, he's not honest enough. He said he's here for truth. He can't concede when he's wrong. And he knows he's wrong, and he's trying to spread lies. Why? He thinks Mo Moses is not a Muslim because he didn't go to the Kaaba, or because he didn't pray five times a day. When this man concedes he was wrong, yeah, and he's been educated today, then we can progress and see how honest this guy is. And let's see if he's really after truth. He accepted you're right. He accepted. If he's accepted I'm right, then he should concede and apologize and take it back for the benefit of the camera. No, of course he doesn't. He's too arrogant. He's not here for truth. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Actions speak louder than words. Sounds to be honest, bro, I don't think I don't think that even though like you seem like a nice guy, because of what you said about arrogance is okay with God, you shouldn't really be in front of the camera door. Well then, that means that you're saying God is okay. No, the law is not It's a crime to God though, isn't it? Not under this law. Has it started? We don't know. That's what he's talking about. Just kill it, yeah? But then he's not a God then. Yeah. He shouldn't be preaching about God. So if he's Remind me of your name. So petty. Don't touch me. Remind me of your name. What are you doing? On camera, do not touch me. It's not important. Remind me of your name. Tai. Tai. You know what you should do, Tai? Come with a ladder and just preach. Because you can't debate. Just preach. Hamza, uh, for the camera, keep your hands to yourself. It's not important to touch me. It's not. <laughs> for the benefit of the camera, touch him once. Okay. In, in, a, in, a, in a, just to get his attention kind of way. No, you're the one who wants attention. I don't know why he's so paranoid about being touched. 